The roster of swimmers who will represent Team USA in Paris is also set. Yeah, and the men will be led by someone who's no stranger to the games. Stuart Moore sat down with coach Anthony Nesty, who has made history himself. He's a legend in and aside the pool, literally. In 1988, Anthony Nesty became the first black man to ever win Olympic gold in the water, winning in the 100-meter butterfly. Now, 36 years later, he's still at the Olympics, this time leading Team USA. It's a big honor for me, of course, and uh, representing the U.S. in that capacity. It's um, lots of uh, emotions. It's um, exciting, um, nerve-wracking, um, but... Uh, you know, I've been to many Olympics as a coach before, so I, I, I know what to expect. And uh, uh, in the U.S., we always have great athletes and a good staff, so I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. His historic achievements as an athlete have translated to success poolside as a coach. Nesty has led the University of Florida as head coach for the last seven seasons, and he's been on staff for 27 years. His resume and team success on both the men and women's teams is lengthy. But the Olympics won't be easy as the competitors from all over the world are focused on beating Team USA athletes. For, for us, uh, obviously going against the Australian is, 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 is a big thing. Um, it's a big challenge for us, of course. Uh, but uh, if you look you know, ac across the board and look at the other countries, they're, they're performing at a really high level. Most of the kids uh, train in the US, not all of them, but, but, but some of them do. And, uh, you know, just, it just shows you how, um, you know, at the Olympics, um, how serious other countries take that moment. And, and I'm a firm believer, you don't want any stones unturned, so you do all you can to, to, to be at the best at the right time. At the Tokyo Games, Team USA men's and women's teams combined to win 30 medals in the pool. Nesty says he wants more. I'm kind of... Uh, greedy as it comes to performances. I want the best performances for my athletes. That, um, you know, th that is the goal of any coach. Um, so my, our job as, as a staff, um, as, you know, obviously U.S. Swimming being the, the governing body, we're, we're going to go to Paris and, and see how many medals we can win and see if we can make history. On the road to Paris, Stuart Moore, back to you.